Hello, today I'm here with a new video and it's time for the part 2 in the Kaleidos Futurism collection. And I am of course taking the Futurism 2 and this is the Cyber Barons palette. And if you don't know why I'm like, this is part 2. Um, I am doing one video on each of these palettes. I can leave my first video up here. And when I have done all the three palettes, it's coming a review video on these. Review and search. So, <laughs> my last video was on the cyber green. Sci-fi green. And... Uh, now it's time for the cyber bronze and this palette it looks like this so I don't want to I like the packaging but it's not YouTube friendly so these are six colors three mattes and three shimmers and I don't think it was the same layout was it three shimmers in this no this is it only two shimmers The green had only two shimmers, but this has three shimmers and three mattes. And I think I want to try to use all the color in this palette as well. I did use all the colors in the other palette, so I will try to use them all in this palette as well. So I will zoom in a little bit, I will think a little bit what I am doing, and then we just get started with makeup. Okay, so I think I have decided. I will start with this one and that is droid I think I will take this on a fluffy brush and put it in my whole crease um, I don't know how dark this is pretty dark but not too dark and as you can see I have my eyebrows on When I got home from work, we went um, to the store to get some groceries and then I was like, I'm going to feel now I didn't want to take my brows off. So that's why they're on. I really like their like normal shades in these palettes. Um, this is a really nice brownie. Also like it a, a little dirty and I like that and it is, it is so easy to blend and these three looks I think they were going to be pretty shimmery because the shimmer shades in these palettes are amazing and it feels like when you have three shimmer shades do something shimmer and fun and then I want to deepen down my crease a little bit and I will take this one and that is carbon and I take this on a smaller blending brush and just put it in the middle of my crease and I know this is not so small but for me it is I love me some big blending brushes I want to concentrate it out here but also take it the whole way in and then for my lid I want to take this red one I swatched it a little bit before and um, this is infrared and I will try with this brush I think it will work I straight up love this shade. This is such a nice shimmer red. It's like a little bit metallic and I I love that. And it doesn't feel like I usually do looks like this. I only take one shade on my whole lid but this is 
an amazing color. And I will go in with the brush that I took the darker shade in my crease and just blend the edge out a little bit. I actually think I am happy like this. Like the fastest thing ever but I can't stop looking at my eyelid because it is just amazing. It feels like this look a little bit like Swan in the Kat Von D and Too Faced palette. And I love that shade and I want to find a dupe for it. So I actually think my lids are done like that and I can actually swatch the Kat Von D shade next to this. It's in this Better Together the she made with Too Faced. And it's this one. Okay, so this is the Kat Von D shade. And this is the Kaleidos shade. They are pretty similar. Maybe the Kat Von D shade is a little bit... It's a little bit darker. And like... Not as metallic. It's a little bit more brown and this is a little bit more red. So I actually think I like the Kaleidos shade better. And that's good. So I'm going to take away the fallout. Fix my base. And then we do the under eyes. And I have... Three colors left. I will make this. So I will take away the fallout. Fix my base. And then I will be back. So the face is on and we have three colors left. We have this one, this one and this one. So I will start with this and take it on my lower lash. And I don't know how dark it is. We will just wait and see. And then I will go in with this one. And I don't think I need to spray this because they are so damn good and this brush was not a good brush. It was a little bit too big so I take this smaller pencil brush instead and, and no I do not need to spray this. And now I only have one shade left and it's the silver one. And this I will of course pop in my inner corner. I do not know how this will look but... I just have to wait and see because this red feels pretty warm. So oh, that is uh, the finished eyes and I have used all these six shades. So I will put on mascara, a lipstick and then I will be back with the finished results. So this is the finished look and I used um, the red pen from Linda Hallberg, Anger Mood in my watch line and for lips I used Liquid Courage from Colourpop. And yes, this may be like three palettes with red lips, but you know me, I love my red lips. So this is my first impression with the Cyber Bronze, and I am in love with this shimmery red. I think it was called Infrared. I am really not a fan of these. Not a fan at all. Um, but this is... A really good palette as well. I will try to save as much for for my review part as possible so I don't want to talk a lot about the palette in these first impression videos but my first impression is really really good it's as good as the first one the sci-fi green so I really like this one as well and the red shade it is freaking amazing so I am really happy with how this look turned out I love red as you may know both on my eyes and on my lips so I really hope you like this video and if you want to see 
um, <laughs> the third palette, it will come up on... It should be Friday, because it should be Wednesday when you see this. So that will be up on Friday. Or Thursday. It depends where you live. But for me, it's Friday. So I really hope you liked this video. And if you don't... If you don't... Da, 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 if you do not... If you don't subscribe to my channel, please do. So you don't miss any of my videos. And I will see you in the next one. Bye!